Hi, I'm Chuck Softage. I'm with uh, OPW Petrovent. Today we're going to show you some diagnostic tools that can be used that we we found out that may help diagnose any problems with Petronet. So what we're using is a small oscilloscope, very inexpensive, less than a hundred dollars, um, set up to diagnose any noise that may be coming on the wire that may be affecting the communication we're trying to use. So we're currently using some Petronet wire connected to a junction box and we're watching the oscilloscope the way it is. You can see we're getting some movement on it because we're not grounded anywhere but we don't have anything affecting it too bad. Now I have a fluorescent light here that I'm holding even without turning the fluorescent light on, if I get, get it near the Petronet wire, you're going to see lots of noise coming into the Petronet wire. Now if I turn the light on, all that noise is coming into the Petronet wire. All that noise means we could be losing the signal in our site controller, or that our Petronet wire or our communication between our PCM boards or our DPC or anything else could be failing. We are currently using a, a shielded Petronet wire from the junction box. So even with the shielded wire we're still picking up some noise from the fluorescent light. So if you're running wire in a gutter box with other high powered wire anywhere near lights, any of that kind of stuff, this is the kind of noise that could be affecting the operation of the system. I'm using a, a simple oscilloscope clip system. So I've got an alligator clip on one wire with a, a little gator, a little style clip on the other and I'm basically connecting to the Petronet wire creating monitoring the noise that's going on the loop of the wire. So these come with either a pin to be able to pin test or a little slip on clip that you can clip it to the wire so you're not having to hold it. So what we're going to do next is we're going to hook up some unshielded wire and show you the difference between noise on an unshielded wire and noise on Petronet wire. Okay, so now we've hooked up some unshielded wire, the same way alligator clip clipped it. Now we're putting a light next to the wire unshielded. You can see we're already seeing noise even without the light being turned on. So now I turn the light on and look at how much noise we're seeing. This is unshielded wire. So if you're using unshielded wire for Petronet, you're already introducing noise into the system. So one of the things we're recommending is the ability to isolate the systems, take a look at the system if you're having issues, isolate it from the junction box first, trace it down and isolate it in places to see where you're getting noise. See if your wire connectors aren't done or if the wires aren't grounded properly or if wires are being run in troughs with high powered wire or in conduit with other wire that's not recommended by the manufacturer. So this is just a tool to be able to use to help troubleshoot any communication issues you may be having at site. 